guys, so we're gonna get right into it. Welcome to my channel. I just wanted to come and show you quickly what I had gotten from the TJ Maxx near me, as well as Marshalls. Um, so we're gonna start from here. Well, as you can see, I was able to actually snag one of the Kat Von D Shade and Light Contour Palettes. This particular palette in my store uh, was $24.99, and I'm really excited to try that. It's kind of all the rave right now, um, and even before, and maybe it's died down, who knows. But I'm actually kind of really excited to give that a try. Um, so, and you know, being able to also get it on a discounted price, it's... You know it's kind of exciting and please don't mind me I'm not showing my face I'm kind of you know messy here about to get ready for work um, but anyway so the next thing that I got was it's this makeup brush uh, cleaner type of thing where you actually kind of swirl your brushes in in between applications so you're able to use different colors I got that for $3.99 um, so I'm really excited to try that and they also have actually um, different, uh, well, not different, but um, like instructions on how to clean the actual sponge, so that way you can use it uh, from you know time to time, and not have to, it's not like a disposable thing. It's like something you'll use continuously once you clean it up. The next thing I found was actually a Bite Beauty lipstick. This actually was not swatched, as you can tell there, and I love it already. I like the bullet size, and I like the embossment of the B for Bite. This particular one was $6.99. It says compared to $11, but I'm sure it was more expensive than that. Um, but I'm really excited to try it out, see how nice it is. I haven't swatched it or anything. I kind of wanted to get this video uh, done. And I apologize for the shakiness. I'm actually using my phone so I can get some flash because my camera doesn't have flash. And anyway, so the next thing as you can see here is a liner and brow cream from e.l.f. This is in the shade uh, light brown. And I had gotten this for $3.99. I think maybe at Target or Walmart at something maybe around $3 mark, maybe a 4 maybe around that price. So any discount is pretty good. The next thing is a Too Faced La Creme Color Drench Lip Cream. This also was not swatched, as you can see there. And I really like the packaging of it. This is in the shade Juicy Melon, so I'm really excited to give that a try and see, you know, if these br uh, brands that are a little bit more expensive or all the hype, um, because again, I don't have many higher-end items, so to get them on a discounted price is pretty exciting. The next thing I got is the Body Shop Tea Tree, and this is something I've been actually using a couple of days already, kind of before I go to bed and right as I wake up. Um, when my face is clean. This is a skin clearing modifying toner. It says it's suitable for blemished skin. I have some blemishes on my skin, um, but we'll see. It, it does feel nice, um, kind of like a medicated feeling. Um, you do have to shake it up well because there's some sort of um, white uh, substance at the bottom that's supposed to be used you know, to help for the skin. So I am going to be doing some more research on what that actually does, but I saw Soph does nails and I'll link her channel down below. I know she talked about it, I believe, because she does a lot of, uh, you know, supported content by the body shop because she just, she likes it. And so I'll make sure to link hers down below her channel. I don't know if I'll be able to find the exact video, but um, that's where I first heard it from. The next set of items I got was Bella Pierre. Uh, Kiss Proof La Creme Quad, and it comes with four in a pack, and I love the colors. And when I took them out of the packaging, they actually feel very, very luxurious, very heavy as far as the um, the packaging itself. It doesn't feel cheap. And I remember Bella Pierre because I had gotten a, uh, what is it, I think it was an eye pencil, like an eyeliner, in a boxy charm, and I wasn't too fond of the eyeliner necessarily because it didn't feel like it came on as creamy as it could have but I figured you know why not try the lip creams and it says it's kiss proof so I definitely want to try and see if that's something that you know won't transfer I had gotten that for $7.99 it says compare at price was $12 oh and this one was $7.99 as well and you see there the white substance that's why you have to shake it up a little bit more so that's exciting. And then the last bundle here was the e.l.f. four-piece Total Essentials Lip Kit. 
and it comes with three lipsticks and a lip pencil. And it seems like it's going to be colors that, of course, I like. They're the berry tones, kind of nude tones. And this set I had gotten, let's see, $4.99. So, oh, that's what I got there. And that's just a quick little haul, you know, as far as what I was able to receive and the fact that I was able to snag up some items that were not touched and tampered with. Um, so please let me know what you've recently found as far as, you know, Marshalls or TJ Maxx. If you um, have some things that you think I should try out, um, if it's there, of course, and maybe I can also even try to check online, see what's there. Um, let me know. But uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. I know this is my second kind of haul. And the last time I just recently did a haul, but it was only a couple of things. So this was a little bit more, and I don't know, it's exciting being able to see these items and trying to save, you know, some money with it. So, anyway, thank you for taking the time to watch the video. I hope you'll subscribe if you're not already, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.